I went on a diet, like, throughout the season because I felt like I needed to do better this season. And I feel like dieting and losing body fat would help me get back to where I was my freshman year. And so, yeah, I just dieted and then, you know, worked out extra hard. Sometimes the extra work and it benefited me. And I feel it. Today, I felt, I felt great. He said you're the leader of the running back room. That obviously goes without saying two years you've played here. And uh, just what do you feel about the growth of those younger guys that you're, you're dealing with? A couple of them are just getting started with their career. Just what, what do you see out of that group as a whole? Uh, they're, they're some hard workers, you know, so I feel like if they keep working hard, they'll be good. And they just got to keep learning the offense and just just watch and learn how to do it here so you can succeed. What's the hardest part for those young guys? Is it mental, learning the responsibilities on each play, or is it, uh, you know, can also be, I guess, the physical, the grind of this whole thing day after day? Well, I mean, I can't speak for them, mm -hmm. but, like, when I was a freshman, it was just, like, the time is different to practice. The practice is much longer than high, than high school, you know, and, you know, the guys are faster. The game is faster. So you got to learn offense so you can slow the game down because that mm -hmm. helps a lot. So I just think if they learn the offense first and then everything else will follow the play. Jay, what's the difference for you from a, I don't know, mental standpoint, a confidence standpoint to know that you're sort of the, the, the lead dog in that room for one of another term? You know, you and Mike were there last year. What has that done for you from a, I don't know, a comfortable standpoint of getting ready for this season? You Knowing that they're leaning on you, but obviously you're the number one guy. Uh, well, I love having Mike here, and I mean, I, like, there was benefits to sharing carries, but knowing that I'll be getting more carries in, in my first two years is kind of a good feeling because, you know, I, I'll be able to get into a rhythm and stuff like mm -hmm. that. So. I think that helps a lot. And what's what's the down what's the downside of sharing carries? Yep. What is the downside? Maybe I'm not as fresh at the end of the year, but we'll see. Yeah. JK, we've we've talked about all these different things with you. You seem motivated off of last year. You went on a diet. You said you felt great today. Like, what are you? What are we talking about here? What what could you do this season? What are well, you thinking about? What this season could be like for you? Well, I mean, there's a lot of. A lot at stake. I mean, my main goal is to win a national championship, of course. And I mean, with that, I just feel like I'm the best running back in the nation. And I want to prove that. And I didn't last year. And I have a chip on my shoulder because I know I can do better. But it seems, it, seems, so like, it seems like mentally, physically, with your diet, there's a lot of things. Do you feel things are sort of coming together? Yeah. I feel like everything's coming together. Yeah. At the right time. Okay. And JK, knowing that you're going to have a, a first year quarterback, probably Justin, but whoever it is, you're going to first year quarterback. And Ryan Day has said the rest of the team has to pick up the slack. And how much responsibility do you feel that way? That not only do you have to bring you have to have a great start, you have to be the guy from the start. Yeah, I mean, I want, I want to have that responsibility of the team leaning on me in time of need, you know? So. With that being said, I mean, that's why that's another reason why I went on the die because I know I'm going to have to help my team out a lot because, I mean, we, we have some talented guys at quarterback, but they haven't really played before. So I feel like me helping them and being there right alongside of them, knowing what to do and being experienced will help them a lot. So. I mean, running backs only as good as his offensive line. You've got four new starters, four mm -hmm. or less. How good do you feel about the potential of that unit? Uh, I'm going to just say y'all see this year how good that offensive line is going to be. They might be new, but they won't seem new. I mean, there's like some of the new guys. They're all like top 50 national recruits, right? I mean, like top 50, like top 20. Yeah. I mean, so you see you see that talent there. Oh, yeah. They're, they're hard workers, and that's what matters. They got the talent, but they're also hard workers. So you'll see. How does it show up in the – how does it show up literally in what you're seeing from a blocking standpoint? How does it show up? Uh, you know, it just uh, things are there. You know, uh, things are going to be there, and I can trust it. And they they're there every time. You know, leaving the field at the Rose Bowl, you said to a couple of us. I mean, basically, for want of another term, I'm paraphrasing. Uh, national championship or bust, sort of. Do you still feel that way about this team? That this team has that kind of potential, considering everything y'all lost. You got a brand new head coach. You got new coaches on the defensive side. What what gives you confidence about this team? Uh, the brand new coaches on the defensive side. Uh, one came from the, uh, <laughs> the team up north, and that defense is pretty good every year with him there. Mm -hmm. And I mean, our new head coach is, uh, he's going to be legendary, I feel like, and 
he's not really that new, and we're comfortable with him. And I think he's going to run his team correct. You know? he, and what about your quarterback? I mean, what, what do you feel about Justin? I mean, what's, what's giving you confidence in him? He's a hard worker. He, he wants to be great, and that's, I think that's a good trade. What's been your guys' Two more questions. over the summer? Like, how is that kind of uh, me, and, me and Justin, we hang out quite a bit, uh, you know, outside of the Woody. And so I feel like that'll help us. And uh, I just feel like we connect. I think it'll be good. <laughs> Coach Day says this a lot, that the best way to learn is through failure. you got a great career here, obviously, and nothing you've done here has been failure. But again, what we keep talking about is the idea that you feel like you weren't as good last year as you could be. Are you going to be better this year because of that? Uh, yeah, uh, I think I needed it last year. You say it was a failure, but to me it was a failure. Really? Yeah, definitely. Failure? So what's better look like? You're for a thousand yards. Yeah. <laughs> what, what, what's better look like if you've got a thousand yards and we can your show first you and failure second if you season? See. Uh, I mean, I rush for a thousand yards, but I mean, I feel like I can rush for way more yards this year because I mean, it was a failure. The last year was was a failure to me, and just more pop, more explosion, more everything you'll see this year. So is there a number that's like? Success for you? No, it's, I ain't gonna say anything. I'm just gonna let it play out. Is it the number or Last is it question. how it looks sometimes too? It's definitely how it looks sometimes. I think so. Because it was, I think, as effective, but freshman year looked better. Yeah, yeah definitely. Um, it looks, it looked way better freshman year, and it felt better. Uh, this year did not feel as good, and I feel like I can do much better. I think uh, I didn't, you know, make defenses fear me as, as I should. You lost 4% body you, weight. What's your body fat? What's your weight at now? Uh, I'm 215. I'm right around the same. So lost 4% body fat and are the same weight. Mm -hmm. Okay. What's your current body fat now? Uh, eight. Okay. Yeah. It's pretty good. So it was more than yards per carry. It. Yeah, it was more yards per carry. <laughs> 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 right. Yeah, yeah. Thanks, JK.